Google reviews are very important today. Um, you know, uh, when, when someone's looking for a dentist, typically what they do is they do a Google search. Uh, and when someone's looking for a dentist, one of the first things they'll look at is not only the number of reviews that you have, but the average star rating in your reviews. The more reviews, the better. It's validation. It's like third-party validation. But I want you to have a system to consistently get more Google reviews. Now, I'm going to walk through in detail a five-step system for you to get uh, a high number of Google reviews. Uh, here's that five-step system. Number one, have someone on your team show up to the morning huddle. I'm tying it back to the morning huddle again with uh, the email addresses of everybody on your schedule today. Step two, have that person highlight uh, the email addresses that are Gmail addresses. Because while reviews on, on any review site could be useful, um, the granddaddy of review sites, of course, is Google. You want to get those reviews on Google, and they have to have a Gmail address to write a, a Google review. So now we have the names highlighted of people that we're seeing today, whether it be doctor or hygiene, that have a Gmail address. Step three in this system is look, have, look at every one of those names and identify people that you flat out know that are highlighted that you flat out know would write you, write you a five-star review. When in doubt, don't ask them. Step four is once we have them, maybe you have five people today. I'm just making up numbers for an example, Aaron. Maybe you have five people today that have a Gmail address and four of them you know beyond a shadow of the doubt would write you a five-star review. Then we're going to assign a specific team member to ask that patient for a review. And we're going to you know, kind of do that organically. Hey, who would like to ask Linda? Who would like to ask Bob? Who'd like to ask Rachel? Could be the hygienist, could be their assistant, could be the doctor. It could be an administrative team member that has a connection with the patient. And step five is we're going to print out, it's about a five by eight card. We're going to print out a card that has the instructions on how to write a Google review. And we're going to say something like this. If I was your hygienist, Naren, and you're one of the people that we identified to ask to write a review, we're going to say, you know, Naren, I sure love seeing you in my practice. By the way, you are right on time. Uh, for your uh, hygiene appointment. I, I wish all my patients were as committed to their health as you are. But you know, Naren, we love seeing new patients as well. We, we want to help as many people as possible have great oral health. Would you do me a favor and write us a Google review when you get a chance? And then I, hand, I said, Naren, I went ahead and took the liberty of pr printing out this little cheat sheet with instructions. Um, hey, thanks in advance. I, we sure appreciate it. And now Naren's going to take that and typically put it in his uh, pocket. Later in the day, uh, when he reaches into his pocket, he's going to see that uh, card. It's going to remind him to do a Google review for you. Now, Naren, I meant to ask you to do this while I was talking about the system, but could you pull up on Google My Business and tell me as of today, how many Google reviews LifeSmiles has? I will put it up. As of this very moment. While he's looking, uh, Doctor, I really want you to get behind uh, this uh, third uh, uh, recommended system in the five most important systems. It'll make 1,000, 1,077 Google reviews, uh, five so stars. 1,077. What's the average five-star rating? Uh, it is five stars. The average is five stars. It's five stars. Yes. 1,077 guys, the way we got 1,077 reviews is what I just described to you is that system. Go for it. You can do the same thing. And to speak back on Gary's point, um, you know, I know the stats because, you know, I look at it every month uh, with my team. Life Smiles gets around 120 new patient calls every month. Of course, it used to be 30, 40, and over six years, it kept growing, growing, growing. All of it comes from uh, organic marketing, which is SEO and Google reviews, uh, Google Maps. And Google Maps is becoming a bigger and bigger portion of how Life Smiles gets these 120 new patient calls. So one of the stats we look at is, um, you know, uh, Google My Business. So every single month we can find out through Google My Business dashboard, how many people are seeing that profile, what keywords they're using, and how many phone calls are coming up every month, along with how many driving directions are coming up. So the point that I want to make is, yes, reviews are awesome. But if you also play your SEO cards right, you're going to get 30, 40, 50 extra patients every single month because... Google is going to show you your Google Maps page when people type in specific keywords. So when they type in veneers, when they type in Invisalign, you're going to show up. 
And that's going to start increasing your new patient um, flow as well. So it's technical. So you need some help with this, but it's really, really powerful. Really good point, uh, Niran, for sure. 